Good afternoon, everybody. Five men are on the run from the law after they escaped from a halfway house. Investigators say they climbed the fence of a Los Lunas facility to get liquored up, climbed back in, and escaped again. News 13 Scott Daniels is live in the Newsplex with this story. Scott. Deanna, one guy just turned himself in about an hour ago in Las Vegas, New Mexico. Law enforcement says that these guys could be anywhere. Their crimes range from larceny to burglary to grand theft. Officers for the New Mexico Corrections Department are searching for Jose Flores, Stephen Bunker, Scott Toledo, Michael Pennegraft, and Anthony Gallegos. So far, Daniel Royball is the only one to turn himself in. That was about an hour ago. Investigators say on Sunday night, the six scaled the fence of the New Mexico Men's Recovery Academy. They got booze and they came back. By 1.30 yesterday morning, investigators say they did it again, but this time they left for good. Now the New Mexico Corrections Department is working with the U.S. Marshals, Valencia County, and state police to track them down. These six are all either parolees, probationers, or both. One of the officers searching for them says they are not considered dangerous. We think they're, they're pretty spread out since they come from different counties within the state. So it's, uh, it's going to be a process, but we will bring these guys back into compliance. Now, if they get caught, all six will have to face a judge, and the three of which who are parolees will most likely be going back to jail. Back to you. Okay, Scott. Now, according to the Drug Rehab Facility's website, the building can house up to 85 men at once. No word on how many men were there during this escape.